Very important now, having those two impacts could be used to deal with some of that utility here as Palu goes aggressive, spots out the drone, tries to go for the shots into Skies, but not be dealing too much damage as both will stay alive. Yeah, Skies is waiting for somebody to drift a little bit closer here. They're still playing with that intel and information game. They have a bit of an eye, but Nesk has another one, and there's one more, Nesk! with a triple kill across the middle of the floor and suddenly it's just Skies. He's dropped down to split and dropped Moringa, but they know exactly where he is and there's a minute for them to try and do something else here. Nesk set himself up with a low hold now. He's aware that the rotation's coming up back around the top here. He's holding the angle, waiting for his fourth, doesn't find it, but Sexy Cake is there to close the round the same way he opened it. Maybe at some point any of these Dark Zero members will be pushing through. And it seems like it's going to be a horizontal take. There is barely anybody left on the top floor, I would dare to say, to try and make sure that these well, anchor points are going to be unplayable for the likes of Liquid. Now, it is NGO that is just waiting at the door. There's 30 seconds left. They need to get the pace in now, and the Blitz will definitely start doing that. There goes another smoke canister on the door, but Mint himself is going to try and dig deep. Skies kills NJR. A little bit of blue on blue, and it's the red that starts to take advantage as the shield goes deep, knocks down the man on the corner, goes for one more just before they're able to actually find somebody else, though. Ten seconds and a cold diffuser. They've got to try and pick something apart, but Eclipse is on the other side of the world, and now... Well, there's nobody else inside to pick things back together, DZ. Well, here for Dark Zero Hyper, down low on HP, two already taken care of. And then you're looking at what Dark Zero have left, right? They have one air jab, they have two concussions and an impact, and 18 sets of Xkyros available to them. What can you do with that? Well, you're on that top floor, so for a start you can open up the VIP angle, hoping that you can maybe get a kill on drinks, but Palu will be taking down Hyper, makes it even harder as now Skies is the last man standing. Yet again we find Skies as the only name on the board and he's got everything to do in front of him. Barely anything taken out of the site, but he's at least able to find the first kill against 30 seconds left. It's a 1v4 situation. You do not have much time left. The flashbangs are being tossed in. The pre-fires are there with a the Type 89, but it's not that much more. Allowing them to play from the blue side. Hoping that they are going to be able to stall out DZ long enough because what control do they really have? Nothing much. As they still don't have any verticality. Still need to start creating that if they want to use an NGR will drop and that is not going to be helping them. I think Ness got one. I have a feeling that the Blitz died on Hookah Valk as well. I don't know why, but I thought I saw a body there earlier. Either way, it's been doubled up and joined by someone else's Eclipse. Desperately looks for something from the verticality here. They've got it, but they've got to try and make use of it, and they can't quite get the angles, because yet again, Liquid, what they're feeding them is only when they want to take. Hyper gets one, gets dropped, gets picked back up there with a one versus three now. He's spraying in the middle of the pillar, but Palu is the one that pulls apart the pose. Very costly there, what we saw on that top floor. You saw the vertical angle being used, and you saw him move through. Didn't spot out the player initially, then wanted to go for the repeat, but at that point was already spotted himself. And and that is to see if he can potentially maybe apply some pressure up Cool Vibes. He has that option to rotate and offer some support to the bodies that are above. But again, what we've seen from Liquid is they'll hold these holds for as long as they need to, but then more than able to go, okay, now we fall back to offer some cover and support. Palu, in the meantime, blows Eclipse into the skies and leaves them yet again with a man deficit. And the issue is here that there's not a single grenade being used by any of the Dark Zero members as Ness gets a second C4 kill, just absolutely insane. NGR goes quite low as well, a double down coming in, and Skies is the last man standing as Ness just finishes it off with the uh, SMG-11. Now going for the aggressive beacon, it's going to be a quad kill there for Nesk. Liquid, round five, and look at them, they're absolutely energetic right here. And well, I'm, I'm looking over the setup that Dark Zero has been bringing. We haven't seen a single nade operator being used. Toxic beauties. They will no longer be able to be tossed into a position. Now Dark Zero have the opportunity to try and go for a default plant. So you see them trying to take care of... Is that a grenade they just used? Yeah, they just used the grenade to try and get rid of the uh, Surya Laser Gate as NGR picks up a kill onto Nesk right now. And Sexy Cake is in a good spot to go for a potential flank. He takes out the uh, the airdrop as well, I believe. NGR is able to get off the board, but they don't quite confirm the kill. He crawls away, dropped 
the wrong thing just to vase the diffuser however planted in and amongst the mess they were able to find their way through they lost a couple of bodies and njr still on the floor he'll oh. probably get dropped but moringa drops one of his own and suddenly it's only hyper left against the rest he's down in luggage he's able to try and offer himself a bit of space here they just have to have one go for the diffuser and the cover the swing comes and moringa goes 20 seconds left sexy cake in a clutch situation here to put them on map point but hyper keeps them with a lifeline gives them one very necessary and needed round and dark 40 actual kill potentially in the hallway or not oh this is good swinging steadily nesk moves inside the explosion hyper's pulled back to hold the angle as the grenade pops just behind the mirror window but nobody's home now the mirror window pops too they're playing this as if they are still there they're aware that someone was what around the place, the but it's hatch? Esk that drops the hatch, finds Mint, finds the site, finds no! Sky shuts them down and is able to do a very, very important maneuver, which is not lose the site. Hyper locks off Palu on the top floor and is able to keep that lock down. They believed they'd cleared this out after the success of before, but he didn't panic, kept his cool, and now, well, he's found himself a rotation back down to the site itself. Eclipse has himself that ability and has himself a double kill. A C4 pops off and so does Dark Zero. They found v V4 situation, not even having a diffuser in your hand. You need to make sure that you use this time wisely. And what well, it might not be by tossing it out in the open. So just taking it as long as you possibly can to make sure that you discuss what needs to be discussed for the next round because this did not go as planned. PSK quick peeking around the corners of the luggage to see if anybody's home, but it's otherwise all stacked around this northerly corner. There's the body in Hooker and obviously the extension around the vase at the top of the stairs. One on Cool Vibes 2. It's a bit of a crossfire. You've angled yourself into. You go for one, get dropped, get traded. All across the board, we're finding pressure here, but it's Dark Zero able to get a little bit of solidity back. There's a man on the billiards table. They might not know how close he is, but Eclipse doesn't even care. Drops it. As Moringa dances and eyes the danger door right next to the site itself. Can't quite see anybody on the jiggle, but has opened the soft wall either side as Eclipse is rotated round to offer Skies some support. New Gemmer Dare will be making sure that Skies' his phone will not be ringing. This doesn't really seem to matter. They have opened up behind the bar, and well, right now that verticality that is in control still of Dark Zero will be really key. So they need to make sure to take the control. Eclipse will go down. Skies is stuck between these two barricades. He is very key right now. Well, they're looking towards it now as it comes over the clutch. Hyper drops one. Skies brings the body balance back to a balance now. The hot pink comes around the corner, but he gets dropped by the man who sees him first. Nesk on a triple now. It's just one body left. No longer Team Liquid put themselves on map. Concentration. Yeah, Moringa just heard a bunch of Sam coming through that hatch, so we'll be deciding to hold it off for a while, making sure that he does not get flanked whilst the rest of Liquid is setting themselves up. In the meantime, we still have one player left in Billards. I believe that is Eclipse playing there. Might be wrong. Yeah, there it is. A very long angle that will be held. In the meantime, a person comes up. Nask gets taken care of. It's back to a 4-4. Four and four. 70 seconds left. Hybrid picks up one as well. Now the curls are starting to flood in. A grenade will be taking care of Skies. And there comes the plan. PSK starting to make it happen. To see Phil will come out, but it's going to be too short. And that means 45 seconds off the clock. This could be Liquid's game. Sexy Gate drive bys one more, and Moringa locks it off on the white stairs. And suddenly it is all over. Blinked, and you missed.